what have we got here? Well, looks like we got ourselves another trial. Oh, good. Sure looks like it. Oh, good. Let's see what these do. Okay, some impressive engineering. Symbols on the spheres don't match the ones in the light. Uh, there's a lot of them. What does the rotate button do? Ah, okay. It rotates the doesn't rotate all the panels, it just rotates the panels on the bottom row. Hmm. But is there even one... Oh, actually, I see, I see. Hang on, if we get this on here... And then rotate, is there... Well, there's not actually a symbol on here. No matter which way around it is. Hmm. Then what, pray tell, is the purpose? <laughs> okay, that one's got multiple. Uh, that looks right. Does that need to be... That probably needs to be half light. Like so. There we go. What is that? Oh, look. Statues. Hyra captains. There's Bonnie uh, Baldridge. Paul Basra. I can't remember that guy's name. Cool. This is Al Basra character. Now we're doing the middle row? Oh, now we're doing top and middle. He was taken to be executed, but he got freed during the battle and blew up the Gunsway's gunpowder cache. Oh, so grateful Avery brought him along? Exactly. He started as nobody, became a fearsome sword. Okay, we need three lines. Spinning both symbols at once. Okay, that works. Not sure about this one, because there's no... There isn't anything, like, where you need these two symbols at the top. So I'm unsure where they would actually go. That one needs to be spun, obviously. I need to find a place where I can spin that one and not the other. All space two apart, apart from this one actually. Is it like that? Yeah, that looks about right. Ah, shit, that one's wrong. Is it like that? No. Wait, what have I done wrong here? Well, there you go. Now you just gotta get him into the lights. Like that? That looks right.
No. I've, have I done it one too many times again? Fuck. It, it looks different. I guess that's why... He, I guess he said, there you go, one earlier than when I pressed it. Okay, go, go, go. I guess it's that. Got it. Here we go again. So I guess we the top two didn't matter in that see. section. Joseph Farrell, William Mays, Tariq Ben Malik, and Christopher Condon. Eight out of twelve. Oh, okay, there we go. Look, symbols on the ring are constantly rotating. Yeah, these ones rotate as you move them. So that's a quarter turn. Yeah, there he is. What's he doing so far from the Barbary Coast? So that works. Where's the other one? You. So how far? That's like three quarters. So I think if I do that, it's good, right? Ah, oh, well, Sam confirms it anyway. Star pirate. <laughs> huh? It's kind of weird. Not gonna lie, I'm slightly bummed that when we dropped down into this whole place, we got the right way first try, because there was quite a big area to explore there, and I was, I didn't think this would be like immediately the right way to go. But I don't think there's gonna be any way back now. Shame. Oh well. Win some, you lose some. Let's see. Boop. Okay, where to now? Shit. Here's your missing Avery statue. Ha! Huh. You know, I'm starting to get the feeling that our friend was a bit of a narcissist. You think? <laughs> yeah. Let's go see what he's got in store for us. I guess that's what was under the um oh, that's uh that's a long way the down. circle thing the hollow what you call it that we stamped on also yes clouds are getting dark it's going to turn stormy so that means the boat bit from the so intro will come later and be honest with me how does this stack up you know compared to your other adventures best one yet lad <laughs> ask me again when we finish I wonder if it will it'll probably make us redo the boat section, which is good, because that was cool. Hopefully they don't change the dialogue like they did in uh, Uncharted 2 when they remade the, uh, when they redid the train section. Don't snap, don't snap, don't snap! <laughs> Didn't snap. Sweet. Very nice. Not gonna lie, it's been so long. It's been so long that I'm not sure I actually remember the dialogue from the opening section of this game, so I probably wouldn't even notice. They are definitely drawing parallels to the second game. It's, they've kind of like split it into 1 and 3 and 2 and 4. Like, 1 and 3 are Drake's Deception, uh, or Drake's Fortune and then Drake's Deception. So they're kind of like a pair. And then two and four are uh, among thieves and a thief's end. So that's kind of like a pair as well. I wonder if that was deliberate at all or whether they, uh, whether it just happened. Okay. Island with monstrous Avery statues to the right. 
so excited, my hand, my hands are literally shaking. Yeah, I know the feeling. It's either that or I just, you know, I need another cigarette. <laughs> Maybe a little bit of ball. Looks like he's got a spyglass, but he's not really looking for it. Maybe he wants us to look through it. Treasure Island, eat your heart out. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yep, storm's definitely picking up. Yeah, this is where that This is where that gap thing was, the chamber. Hey, come on. Sam. Oh no no no. Oh, you do the honors. I insist, come on. Damn straight. <laughs> okay. All right, Captain. What are we looking at? There. So, big skull-shaped island. What? <laughs> island. No skull. It's got to be it. The battalion. <laughs> That's optimistic, considering everything. You know, it is just us here. You're allowed to feel just a little bit of excitement over this. Well, I'll get excited when we get Alcazar's noose off your neck. One. <laughs> okay. What? I said okay. No, 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 no. Your okays are never just okay. It usually means the opposite oh. of okay. Who the hell else? Ah, shit. Hmm. What did that okay mean? Yeah, get the wipers going. Oh, that's interesting. It's not making us replay it. And Uncharted 2 did. Okay, well I'm fine with that too. I enjoyed the opening section, so I wouldn't have minded, because it was much less like scripted than Uncharted 2's opening section, where you literally just hold forward and up kind of thing. Not that that was bad; that was cool too. But I liked Uncharted 4's opening more, so I wouldn't have reminded, wouldn't have minded replaying that. But uh, I also don't mind just getting that little skip. That is fine too. All right, come on, Nate. Chapter 13 Marooned. I, I love the bridge. rain. Sam! Sam, can you hear me? We are very sodden. Sure. That rain is gorgeous. Hmm, which way? Which way? Get your weather effects out for the lads. I'm sure Sam's all right. I feel like I feel like Sam could die. First things first, get to higher ground. But obviously, if he did, I know where you are. It wouldn't be until the end. Alternatively, Sam, Nate could on, die. I, I, oh, I don't know. I can't. I, I can't really see them killing off Nate. I know they've said that Uncharted Four is like the end, but lots of things have an ending and then get brought back in like ten years or whatever. And killing off Nate would be a very definitive way of making sure they can't bring the character back. Because the other option was like kill him off and then have Sam be an Uncharted protagonist after building him up all this game, which I would be all all up for. Like. I am loving Sam's character, and I'd be totally down to play as him for a full game, or more than a full game. He's very interesting. Uh-oh. But I just I, I just can't see them killing off Drake at this point. But maybe they'll prove me wrong. We shall see. 
Sam, God damn it. Sam! Can we hoink ourselves up here? Hoink? Hoink? Very pretty. Very pretty. Around here? Time to shimmy shimmy. But yeah, so long as Drake does live, I feel pretty confident that They'll make an Uncharted 5 one day. Or a reboot or something. But they're not just going to completely retire the character. Unless they do kill him, in which case I will be I will be very surprised. Of course. Everything's gone. But like, he's so famous and so synonymous. So synonymous with PlayStation. That I just find it near impossible to believe that they would just be like, yep, yeah, we're done, we're never using him again kind of thing. Because his name and his face <laughs> sell games. And businesses don't tend to like leaving money on the table. So I reckon in like 10 years or something. Right, Sam can't lose anything else. Maybe for next, next gen. <laughs> like, they'll bring him back. Crazy. Or something. We shall see. Uh, okay. I'm all right. Oh, I'm all right. Oh shit! Just push through. Just push through. Uh oh! Uh oh! Uh oh! Whew. Man, this is oh, this place. gorgeous. <laughs> gorgeous. I feel like this is um, this is kind of like the desert section from Uncharted 3. Hello, do you want to? There we go. This is kind of like the desert section from Uncharted 3, but done right. Like, much more visually interesting in terms of like just it's gorgeous, uh, and also like you're doing a lot more in terms of climbing around and trying to survive kind of thing, but it does feel pretty similar in the, you know, two-thirds of the way through the game, find yourself, find yourself stranded in a <laughs> remote location kind of thing, but I think this is, this is, they've learned from what they did in 3, and this feels better to me. Well, I was saying that, he's really not wanting to go down there. Why not? Is there something else I can grab? This has got to be the way. Or up there? Oh, okay. And then drop. Up you go, lad. Man, this would be so... Look at how tiny these handholds are. And it's literally literally a waterfall pouring on his head. Okay, there we go. Now that I can believe. <laughs> I was going to say, how on earth are you not slipping? Oh my god. Well done, Naughty Dog. That was good. I was literally, I was literally about to say, how in the shit would you not slip here? And then he does. Which is good. How long has he been out for? The rain stopped. Sounds like. Can't hear it anymore. There's a few drips trickling down still, but that's probably just run off. I 
M? Nope. Sick Parvis Magna. Sam. Cool. Gotta get to that creepy mountain. Yeah, this whole place is rather creepy. Just stay put, Sam. Gorgeous though. I'm coming to you. Very gorgeous. Man, this game is so good. <laughs> Shimmy, shimmy. Now, which way around here, or no, maybe not around here. It's cold. Shuffle along through here. Get our shuffle shoes going. Okay. Now we're getting somewhere. I think. I hope. <laughs> let's, uh, let's try this way. There's a whole load of handholds everywhere, but I'm not sure which ones we should be taking. that but I think I've lost my graph oh no back where started Promising. Potentially. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Stuck the landing. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. Oh boy. That would have not been a soft landing. He is directly above that rock. He should have a lot of confidence in his ability to... If, if the rock falls, he can grab another one on his way down. Because he's done that so many times over the course of the series. Rock breaks, grab second rock below. That's like his trademark at this point. on the hunt. I hope I get to shoot Ray for myself. I would greatly appreciate that. Okay. I feel like we could swing over there, but I feel like it wants me to swing onto here. Well, I could totally make that, couldn't I? Let's find out. I guess not. That totally looks like he could make it if the game wanted you to. Damn it. Watch your back, Sam. That should hold. Let's hope. Please work. Please work. Boink. Boink. Where 
to now? Infinity and beyond, I heard. Nowhere across there. I like that there's like all these different possible ways, but they're not all gonna work out, kind of thing. Like, because that's definitely something I've noticed. Can't really be helped, but there's definitely something I've noticed with games of this type, like Tomb Raider, where you're doing a lot of climbing. And it's just like, because it's colored like this, like you can see you can climb on it, there's never any like figuring out the path kind of thing which is fine you don't need the figuring out the path stuff but it's just something i've noticed that they haven't done but then in this game in this at this point there's now like a bunch of possibilities that's not reassuring which is good because it means like you have to actually find the path yourself three crosses jesus dismas gestas also nautical symbol for shipwreck no quarter for thieves Uh, how would I... Where would I go if I fell down there? Not sure. Or maybe... Was I right the first time? Is the way this way? Oh, it's cleared up now. I just don't see... A path. <laughs> I thought I thought climbing up that centre bit must would be it, but then it wasn't. And now I'm kind of lost on where to go. Got up here. There's nothing around there. Nothing further that way. Over here is a collectible and a slope, but the slope looks like it just leads to death, but I guess we'll... Oh, no, we can climb up over here. But then isn't this just back where Jesus. we were anyway? Or is this? No, this is somewhere new. I think. Refreshing. Hello. Okay, this is probably the way to go then. Cool. Oh, very Uncharted 1 vibes here. Hi. <laughs> to climb up there. In those boots? You numpty. Uh, how do I get across to there? Oh, I guess I just keep going up. <laughs> Pretty sure you don't need this. You've picked, you've picked up the piton. Reach towards a porous surface and press square to jab the piton in. Is it piton or piton? It's working. Almost there. That's cool. Okay. I like it. That's the way. Uh huh. Uh huh. I like it. Uh huh. Uh huh. Leap of faith time. God, that would hurt your arm so bad. Nice. Very nice. Slowly making our way around. Oh, 
Oh, okay. Hi. <laughs> Okay. Gonna be getting into some combat soon, probably, then. 